I think there's an expectation from the guests that we are going to work with the most sustainably brilliant produce that we can possibly get. There's an expectation that we are going to deal direct with the farm. There's going to be a total traceability for us back to the animal that we use. So when it comes to pork, outdoor, reared, free range, ethically sourced, direct from the farm. We rent 20 acres of very light free draining soil here in Norfolk to run approximately 100 large black and large black cross rare breed sows. Uh, the system is entirely free range and very high welfare. Without that quality, the, the produce that we put on the plate, it's just never gonna shine through. And it's the density of the meat profile, it's, the, it's that pork that isn't bleached white, it's got that sort of red blood running through it, it's been outside, it's worked its muscles, and that flavor profile changes extraordinary. They are very, very fit and healthy, so there's absolutely no antibiotics used in their production, and they live a happy, healthy life. I would like to see more UK consumers supporting high welfare pig farming systems and turning their nose up at European pig factories. This is our piece of cheek that we're going to use, and you can see the, the contrast of the meat, the fat and the cheek, and you simply could not achieve this result unless you were using the best quality pork, it just wouldn't happen. Inside a crate, it doesn't develop muscle and, and, and tissue because he doesn't snuffle around digging holes and trying to find his food. I think it's incredibly important that the general public that buy the cheap, nasty pork on a regular basis, that they truly understand what they're getting into when they buy that. Do, they, do you want to fuel your body with produce like that, that is full of antibiotics, where the pigs are brought up on slats, where the pigs are quite frankly housed in disgusting state. For what? For a simple saving of money? I think most people are sort of turning their noses up at that.